hello guys here I'll be showing you how to join a server or a computer on your network to your domain controller okay so um, first of all before we start joining we need to make sure that this system is having um, an IP address okay on the network so I'm gonna check that quickly okay so go to properties and then go to IP4 now you can see this these are IP address okay I'm using for this system okay this system is using dot two that's one eight one six two zero dot two okay and then this is um subnet max and now the DNS server is dot one so you have to insert the domain controller okay which can also be the DNS server its IP address here all right and you go for okay okay after doing that you can ping one i two the one six a dot zero dot one all right now you can see we're getting a reply okay from the server now the next thing to do is go to server manager all right if it's on windows 8 you just have to go to the properties of my computer all right and then here you go to local server click on web group all right and you go for change domain select domain here and then you go for contoso.com that's number my domain when I go for enter it asks me the, uh, the the credentials okay of the domain admin so administrator okay and then you type there the password of the domain admin take note of that password of the domain administrator all right now you can see here welcome to contoso.com so now my pc is part of that domain as simple as that thank you very much for watching If you're using um, VMware, if you're using VMware just like I'm doing, okay, you need to go to VM settings, okay, and then here where we have network adapter, you need to make sure it's set to host only before you can get the reply from the server you're pinging when you're using the VMware. Only when you're using the VMware. If you're having, using a normal system on the network, all right, just ping. And then, if you're having problems, basically, it's your cable connection, wireless network connectivity, depending on the kind of network connectivity you're using. All right, so that's how you do it.